Welcome back my lieges. This is Stronghold 3, the Bishop Rhythm, level 13. Let's see. We barely made it out alive, but there wasn't time to stop, to recoup, to gather our forces. We rode all day, without a clue as to whether the Abbey had fallen yet or not, as to whether Lady Catherine was alright. They were already there, inside, waiting until we made ourselves visible. We stood back and waited ourselves for nightfall, and we readied what little forces we had to take back the abbey. And whilst we waited, we prayed that Lady Catherine was still alive. Redham, Earl Swinefoot's brother, is a pig in priest's clothing. His father gave him the title when he was just 15, and he has been abusing his position ever since. Unmask him as the thug he is and bring him to his knees. To do this with your few troops means you must move under cover of darkness and bring the siege to a conclusion before dawn. Oh no! Another siege mission with few troops. That means I'm going to have like five units. Maneuver your troops through the darkness to an undefended side of the castle. Armed peasants are expendable. Use them as pawns. Like they always um, have to stress this, that the peasants are expendable. Almost every single time we have a siege mission, they have to say that. <laughs> Use your archers sparingly and keep them away from missile attacks. Take out enemy archers with macemen first before putting archers into position. Send the macemen and swordsmen to the certain wall and attack it. Curtain wall, sorry. Curtain wall, curtain. Is that the one that deals damage? We have word the enemy is using pitch ditches. Passing close to the edge of the map will help to avoid losing all your troops. Hmm. Edge of the map, you say? So what do we have? Ten swordsmen. Fifteen archers! What? Can someone explain to me what the hell do sappers do? <laughs> I still have no idea. Like, they get demoted from pigs but why it, like the icon looks like they just punch oh my god this is a time mission too okay so this is gonna be just an attempt to see what we can do what is that wait what is this some sort of a trap whoa that's a lot of oh <gasps> What? And I need to do what exactly? Capture the Abbey? Oh, of course. Wait, Abbey, is this the Abbey? This is the Abbey, right? How do I get there? Oof, so I have to go through here, it seems. I mean, I can go through here. Kinda like... The setup though I mean um, hmm yeah this is impossible like I have to go through here so these guys will engage me so no bueno what about this side okay this is actually nah it's still the same yeah so what do they mean by undefended side of the castle everything seems to be fairly the same it's not like I can go through here right wait let me pick one unit and let's see the path I can station my troops here does that mean I can shoot nah that's not gonna happen like it never happens enemy units will always outrange me <laughs> it doesn't matter. It seems like an unfair advantage the enemy AI has. Like, this looks like a good spot, but like I can't go there. There's no way to get there. And I have to go past these guys. I mean, this is slightly less defended, but still pretty defended. But it looks like I have to go through here. But let's, let's, for the sake of interest, since we don't have enough time anyways. 
Does that mean they actually can see me? Like, these probably are, like... Whoa. I just passed some pig guys. Good. Our boars grow impatient. I don't think I can see them better than they can see me. Now it's lit up. <laughs> and someone's clapping. Yeah, we killed a couple of guys, but that was not it, not enough. We are on our way. On our way. Okay, I can outrange them here, but that doesn't help. Deploying. Doesn't really help. Look sharp, lads. Okay. But I can't kill these guys. Okay, so I can outrange them a little bit. It doesn't really change much. Archers moving. Now all they're doing, they're attacking me. And also we don't have time. We don't have time to play this ranged game. So, um, while we still have time, let's... Oh my god, that range. Are you serious? What? Okay, so I guess, like, once the enemy locks onto you, it doesn't matter how far away you go, missiles will still reach you. That's actually a stupid thing, stupid mechanic. That's a very, um... Not really well optimized feature in my opinion. On your command. Once more, we march. So there's a uh, swordsman coming at me. It seems. Oh no! No no no! Don't go there. And they can actually track my units too, even though like this is fog of war. Oh no! What is this? Good. I can't go past. Oh. Do I need to go past here? Wait, where does this lead to? Wait a second. Is that like... Oh my god, is that a back? Okay, okay, let me try... Um, let me restart. Is that like a um, secret alley that leads to the castle? You made it. And you can avoid basically everything? That's interesting. So let's have these guys, these guys, and these guys. That is interesting. Bowman, meet ready. Stick them forks in them. Oh, no, 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 no. Where did that come from? Let's get walking. We're going. Morning, boss. And they can still shoot me. Like, this is stupid. This is the most ridiculous thing I've seen so far. Like, I'm out of range. I should be out of range. But somehow, they can still shoot me because they locked onto my units. Yeah, I, I hate that. Hmm... Now I need to wait for this to uh, give us the target. stop burning. Oh, so there is a path around, I guess. It's a slaughter. We move. Your loyal archers. Wow, I don't know how I am outraging them, but ah, uh, there's more troops here. The mace boys roll. Come on, boys. Can we destroy this, maybe? What? Oh, there's different types of troops here, it seems. And they're hitting. Oh my god, that's a lot of guys. Care of it. 
Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Right oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. They, yeah, just keep shooting across the map. Why not? <laughs> it's not like my units are way off range. No, 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 no. Just keep on shooting. Sounds legit. Oh, wow, they're t they're shooting a lot at. I don't even know what. Oh, we need to uh, explore this. There's probably going to be multiple units stationed around. Okay, let's. Your mark, sire. Deploying. Come on, your honest. Yes. We are honest. We are under attack. Where? Ooh. Set us a task. You mean the defense? Right wow, this is a long path. I don't know if we have enough time to uh My feet hurt. to get across. Moving again. Just give us the target. Ready? Yeah, these will Swordsman. take a little bit of time. On your feet, boys. Wow, we're gonna end up here, huh? So we can go straight on the abbey, but we can uh, end up here on this side of the fence. I see. You're joking. That's impossible. Our boars shall sing. Men to arms. That would be awesome if you could go up there, but that would be too easy, I guess. There might be more traps ahead, though. Morning, boss. Can we have some horses? Oh, oh, oh! Go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Archers moving. Swordsman forward. Okay, these guys will take forever to come here. So we have uh, what? Two archers here. Hey ho! Where's the fight? And we need to basically destroy this part of the wall. We can do it with the uh, ram. Great. Okay, this is going to be a distraction. Woman, on the move. Daggers out no, 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 not daggers. Arrows away. The men nice. Spirits. Swordsman, forward. Okay, pigs might be all right, all right. able to do a better job at this. They should. Wow, these are taking forever to come. Oh my god, yeah. yeah. And you can, like, stack multiple units to attack the same tile of the wall, which is... I think it's a good change. I don't think I should destroy this part of the wall, though. Oh wait, no, I can, right? No, I can't go there. Or can I? Oh my god, if we can actually break through this. It's an open season. Oh my, what? You idiots. What the hell did you just do? Yeah, AI pathing is not great sometimes. Action stations, lads. Take them forks in them. Keep your helmet on, Squire. Waiting for orders. May God Why are you attacking the wall still, you idiots? My God. Nice day, your Highness. Your Highness. Archers moving. Notch arrows. Where are you going? It's a slaughter. Just give us the target. Men to arms! Moving again. Okay. Let's go take it. No way this is just it. No way this is it. We are victorious. What? Sire. Really? <laughs> okay, that was way more easy than I thought. We only spent 14, 15 minutes in this video and uh that includes the failure we had, the first attempt. Okay, that's interesting. 
I mean, okay, so I figured out, I found out in this level at least, that you can attack um, the same tile of the wall with multiple units like you used to in the uh, older Stronghold games, which is, I think, a very welcome feature because it uh, limits the rush capability of just rushing with an insane amount of troops and attacking the same tile and destroying it in, like, second. Same with gates. So they actually mean something, like the walls and, and gates mean more than they used to. I don't know if they're gonna... If it's gonna be different in the new games, if it's gonna be uh, back to, you know, basics, what it used to be, because I've been told that Stronghold Crusader 2 and Warlords, they fixed the issues with building the walls. So I wonder if fixing the issues with building the walls means, um, you know, back to the basics, back to the old build style or whatever. But I, gu I guess, you know, we're, we're gonna see soon enough and uh, let's see if there's an outro. There is no outro. Wow, that was super short mission. I mean, it's cool. I like I like the night feature. I think it's probably one of the cooler aspects. Weather and night features are probably one of the two of the coolest features in this game so far, which I like. And my god, I'm so glad I actually played this game instead of being, ah, oh, you know what, A lot, everyone's saying that this game sucks, I'm just gonna skip it. No, I think this game visually looks awesome. I think it has some really cool features. Sound is also better, in my opinion. Um, and, um, I, okay, so the story doesn't make too much sense, I guess, but, you know, it's not really off, like, it's not really that bad. It's not too different from the other games. I wouldn't say, like, other games had, like, a very good story. Um, yeah, there, there are no cutscenes in this one, as there were in the older games, which I don't think it's a bad thing. Once you get used to the comic style, I guess it's okay. It's not like, um, oh, I'm, you know, like, it's not like it's 2011 right now, and I just crave for the new graphics, for the new cutscenes to see what technology can bring us, you know. Uh, but maybe back then, people were a little bit upset. So, you know... You know, it really depends when you play this game. 2023, I think this game is awesome. I think it actually stands... Um, I think it, it actually doesn't look that bad. Uh, doesn't look that old. I think it came out in 2000, what? 11? 16? I'm not really sure. But it definitely doesn't look like it's a 10-year-old game. If it is a 10-year-old game. Um, it, it looks fairly modern. Um... So, yeah, so far, I can only praise this game. There are a couple of issues with the wall building, with AI pathing, but they're not game-breaking. So far, we haven't seen any massive issues that I've been reading about. So maybe that means this is an updated version. This is like a remaster of the older, ga older game version, which they did for the other games, like Stronghold 2. So it doesn't feel outdated. And I think that is super cool. I think that's a really cool thing. And also, there, we're going to have a new Stronghold game remaster uh, this year, I think. Um, which, I'm not sure we need one. Like, It's not like it's going to look too different, but there's going to be a new campaign, a new story campaign in that game. So I'm actually curious to see that one. So maybe I should get it when, it, when it's out. We'll see. So, yeah, enough blabbering. I've been talking for three plus minutes here. <laughs> Thank you for watching. And if you listened up till this point, props to you guys. Thank you for doing that. And let me know in the comments if you actually managed to stay all the way up to this moment. Because, you know, that's going to be a little, little secret call out for you guys to tell me if you listen to this. And if you want to hear more of my insights. And if you're here only about the gameplay and I should stop blabbering, <laughs> let me know as well. So yeah, thank you guys. See you soon.